Hi, this is Dale with Behind the Bench. Here we are at Genetic Solutions Tour in San Francisco, and this morning we heard a great talk from Danielle Starchevich, who spoke from Mount Sinai Icon School of Medicine. Daniela, can you tell us a little bit about the Resilience Project and some of your work there? Yeah, sure. So the Resilience Project is looking to identify individuals who have uh, very likely detrimental mutations in their genome, but they're healthy. So we're trying to find out what is protecting these individuals from developing the disease, and we're examining a number of different factors, including genetic and environmental, to understand better what is allowing them to be well which has huge implications on potentially helping those who have the mutations but are not well. And you mentioned a pilot project with 47 samples, right, with known difficult mutations to characterize, like in, in, uh, insertions and deletions. Yes. And then you also talked a little bit about the size of the panel. It was really large. Yes, the panel is something that we developed in collaboration with uh, you guys at Life Technologies mm. and uh, it is a panel that is going to have multiple applications across uh, a large number of different research projects. So we actually have uh, greater than 700 genes on the panel and the total size of the panel is uh, around 4.5 megabases. So it's a really large panel and we're looking to utilize it in this very high throughput mode for a large number of applications. Yes. And on top of that, in terms of the high throughput mode, you mentioned the Connecticut facility opening soon. Yes, that's very exciting. So we, uh, um, as you saw in my talk, we have a large number of projects going on and we really need large amounts of data to develop the models that we're looking to develop. Um, so we uh, recently uh, decided to open an additional laboratory space uh, which will be open in Connecticut and it's uh, due to open its door uh, next month so very exciting. Yeah and you mentioned the automation from sample collection all the way through the informatics it was all high throughput. It's designed for many, many thousands. Well, you mentioned up to a million. Right, samples. so just the resilience project, the goal is to sequence one million individuals, and then some of the other projects are also in the you know, tens of thousands of uh, individuals. So, yeah, <laughs> a lot of ad automation and a very exciting time to yeah. be um, doing that. And looking across, as far as the Icon Institute, there were some 300 research investigators. Do I understand that correctly? So the Icon Institute uh, is a little bit smaller than mm -hmm. that. Our department has uh, about 300 mm. people in it right now. And um, you know, we have this very unique environment where we can leverage the research that the 300 researchers are doing. Thank you for taking the time to share with us this morning, Danielle. A pleasure, and thank you for having me here. If you want to follow more of what we're doing at the Genetic Solutions Tour, be sure to follow us on lifetechnologies.com forward slash behind the bench. And if you have any questions for Daniela, please feel free to leave them in the comments.